Hey guys, and welcome to SimCity. This is a new series I'm going to be doing for this game because I love it so much. It's amazing. So we're doing the uh, the archipelago region, and we called it Cam Island because it's, uh, I'm gonna you're gonna find that I make the most original names in the in this game, and I kind of stole that line for. <laughs> Sibs from the Elves cast. Okay, uh, anyway. What kind of city do we want to make first, I guess, is the thing. Uh, Grand Haven. That's going to be a good place to put a tourist city because it's flat. There's, like, no resources, so there's no points in, um, mining for anything. Uh, Inga Island. Uh, you could mine ore there if you want to. Oh, let's, hold on. Hold on a second, let me just sit. Alright, starting the stopwatch. Okay, uh. There's another submit vista. There, there's another place that we could probably put a tourist city. Uh. Holy crap, this is clearly a tourist area because there's no resources here. Um. Is there any oil? There's, there's one petrol bay. <laughs> Where there's just a giant oil field. That's 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 it for oil in this area. Okay, there's a little bit of, there's a little bit of everything here in Trader's Ridge, but um Uh what do we wanna go for first, I guess is the question. What would be a good thing to start us off? It could work a little bit with like a tech city maybe? Um I don't know. Uh I mean, mining, uh, makes a lot of money, uh, culture and, like, gambling cities could make a lot of money, but it needs some serious plan- there needs to be, like, serious planning involved, because otherwise, uh, those could crash and burn real easily. I'm gonna go with a tech city, because I've never really seen anyone on YouTube do a tech city. So, maybe we'll do Summit Vista. Yeah, why not? So let's go here. There's no resources. I don't think we need resources. Well, we could, uh, we're, we're, we... I know that the processor factories need alloys. So, what we're gonna need is recycling and education. That's the name of the, that's the, uh, name of the game for for um brain fart uh that's the name of the game for the um for for a tech city basically electronics so if we go into here this is what we want oh, it's got a nice little highway connecting here that might save us a bit of money so uh well so what we're gonna go for first is this processor factory and that's how we're gonna do it, it might take a while probably will because we need to get our education up and running and I play this game quite slowly um so you can import alloy and plastic from the gold market so we're yeah the recycling center is gonna be key for this so that because then we don't have to spend too much money on alloy and plastic we can just make it there and you could make alloys from smelting factories and plastic from oil refineries but we don't want to do that we recycling is kind of the cheaper way so since we got this big well it's not a huge avenue but it's uh we want to first off make sure that the traffic doesn't get too overflowing here so gotta think about this I gotta think about this uh do we really want to start with dirt roads I think they look pretty ugly number of lanes one uh, so, let's start off by, I'm trying to, I'm trying to plan this out in my head. First thing I like to do is, uh, first thing I like to do is, like at wind, there we go. So, all the wind is blowing this way, so we want our industrial to kind of go in the back here, because, 
We don't want anything. We don't want anything that's gonna pollute the area to go downwind of the uh, residents, because that's just gonna make everyone sick. Um, like I said, we don't even have any resources here. We except for water. Water is pretty abundant. Uh, we're. I'm pretty sure if you put it next to put the water next to a like the ocean or something, you, you don't really run out. So what we're gonna want to do is just make a big road down there. And, um, let's start off with a, uh, dirt road here. Cheapest, uh, for what we're trying to do right now. And, uh, um, so, yeah, power. We also want to think about what we want to do for power. I don't want to use anything polluting because I don't like polluting stuff. I'd go green. I I got the Nissan Leaf DLC. <laughs> it's free, so if you want to go get it. Um, I like solar power plants because they they get a uh, they they generate eight megawatts during peak hours, which is good, and we can add on to that. So it's yeah, a lot. Um. That makes a lot. Nuclear power plants is ideal, but uh, we don't have enough money for that. This is going to kind of put us in the pits for money a little bit because, or, you know, in the hole, whatever you want to call it, because we're, how do I want to say that? Uh, it's, it's reliable, but it's not necessarily cheap. Uh, wind power plant is good for a small city, like, it's cheap, but, um, Uh, wind power is good, so I might use that, but you want to, you're going to need, uh, you're going to find yourself upgrading it a lot and a lot and a lot and a lot. So, I think we're just going to start off right now by zoning some residential right here. Uh, good to get in some residential. And before we do run out of money, let's just get a solar power plant. Why, why not? We, we can, uh, I'll just, yeah, so how are we going to put this? We'll put it right here. Looks good. There we go. That's gonna generate power to our city. It's gonna provide jobs. It's gonna be great. Uh, now for water. For water, we're gonna put an old dirt road here. How long have I been talking? I, I set the timer here and I've already been going on for six minutes. I haven't done anything yet. Listening to me yammering about. Okay, um. Water goes there. Uh, that should be good. I don't think we're ever gonna run out of water because we, we have an ocean right next to it. So, uh, we're we're already in the hole because we don't actually have anyone living here yet. What what I like to try and do, and I learned this from uh, Sips from the Ozcast, is kind of dart res uh commercial into the corners here, and that should cause people to to be in walking distance of an, of a shop and maybe they can like walk to work or just walk to whatever store they want to go is going to be there it'll be good uh basically it's it, it's good for traffic reduction uh getting rid of traffic and uh what else what else is good so is this it's closed, now hiring. No one's even lived in here yet. We're just waiting for people to move in. Let's put it on to llama speed because I want to go a bit faster. Um, I, I don't really like using cheetah speed that much because the game just seems to lag. I don't know. I think things are just going too fast and the game starts to not be able to handle it. So, uh, especially when you have a lot going on. So, we'll just... Uh, uh, brain farts. I like to keep, so I'm gonna keep these episodes around 15 minutes, maybe. Maybe, like, 10, 15 minutes. In that radius. I don't like, I mean, I don't have the attention span for huge episodes. And, um, I don't think you guys want to have that either. So, charging up the photovoltaic cells. Oh yeah, it's powering the city now. So, look at all that power. Look at it. it look at it go. So we've got power, we've got ooh, the position to build town hall has been approved. Yay. Okay. So 
Uh, hmm, government sector. Uh, I might put it. Uh, how about we make a government sector? We'll put a uh in uh avenue along here, I guess. We want to have a good space for this because we're gonna upgrade it later on. So that should be good. I don't... Because... I mean... All the traffic can fill up along this avenue. I don't even care. I just don't want traffic going along this avenue. Congratulations. I've... I've done good. I can name my city now. Instead of Summit Vista, let's name it something else. Something else. Cool. Um... How about... Cam... Tech Vista. There we go. <laughs> That's amazing. Can't tech Vista. Okay. We're all good with that. Um steady flow of water here, no problem. People can go to the bathroom. They can't uh, actually speaking of go people going to the bathroom, they need to get rid of their all of their crap. So hmm. Uh we're gonna we're gonna put our our, our big polluty zone somewhere along the back here. I mean, this seaside area looks good for like certain place for um maybe some maybe some we can get some rich people living beside the sea, but uh we want to uh get our industrial um back in the back so so that the wind doesn't blow towards the uh not enough civilians not crap uh i didn't want to do that i just lost even more money um okay what we want to do is raise taxes a bit so we'll keep them at, we'll put them at 11 percent i'm gonna go bankrupt in a minute let's let's take out a bond <laughs> I hate to do this, but we have to. Alright. It's coming to... It's almost the wrapping up point. So, I'm just gonna get in our basic needs for the city. Let's get the sewage outflow pipe where it just dumps all the crap out into the environment. Which is not ideal. Especially if we're trying to be green. We don't want to pollute the area, but... Until we get the Department of Utilities, that's uh, what's going to have to happen. So, you can see all of, their, all of the people's poop that they're producing going along down the roads into the outflow pipe. Look at all of it, it's just being dumped out. Disgusting. You. Uh, th that, I'll get the Department of Utilities really soon, don't worry. Uh, I forgot to zone some residential here. And we'll see people uh, start to move in more. So it's a very slow developing city, but uh, yeah, well, I'll make it work. So I uh, guess I'll uh, see you later, guys.